A white screen on your Hisense Roku TV is a common problem that can be frustrating, but is often fixable with simple troubleshooting steps. This issue can stem from temporary system glitches, incorrect input source selection, loose cable connections, or hardware malfunctions. First, perform a power cycle. Unplug your TV from the power outlet for 20 to 60 seconds, then plug it back in. This resets the system and resolves many temporary malfunctions. Next, ensure you have the correct input source selected. Use your remote's input button to cycle through available sources like HDMI ports and antenna inputs. Inspect all cable connections, especially HDMI cables. Check for loose connections, damaged cables, and try different HDMI ports or cables to rule out connection issues. If your screen appears black, but you can still hear sound, test the backlight by shining a flashlight directly on the screen. If you can see a faint image, the backlight has failed. These initial troubleshooting steps can resolve most temporary white screen malfunctions on your Hisense Roku TV. When basic troubleshooting doesn't resolve your Hisense Roku TV's white screen, these advanced solutions can help fix persistent issues. First, try resetting the TV's cache using a specific remote control sequence. This can resolve temporary system glitches even when the screen appears unresponsive. Next, check for software updates. Outdated firmware is a common cause of display problems. Navigate to Settings, then System, and look for System Update to install any available updates. If the white screen started after a recent update, you may need to roll back to an older firmware version. This option is usually found in the same System Settings menu. As a last resort, perform a factory reset. This will restore all settings to defaults but may resolve persistent software issues. You can access this through Settings, System, Advanced System Settings, then Factory Reset. If software solutions don't work, the issue may be hardware related. Common failing components include the T-card or polarizer film. These require professional repair or component replacement to fix the white screen permanently.